السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ہو آئی آل اسٹوڈنٹس آئی ہوپ ایوری ون از ڈوئنگ ویل یور انگلش ٹیچر از بیک ود دا نیو لیسن اسٹوڈنٹس وی ہیومن بینگ آر بلیسڈ ود دا فائیو سینسز دیٹ ایز وی کین سی وی کین اسمیل وی کین ٹیسٹ وی کین ہیئر اینڈ وی کین فیل دا ٹچ اینڈ ٹیسٹ از ون آف دا امپورٹنٹ سینس دیٹ وی ہیو and which is the most tasty food that we can taste according to me it's the food made by our mothers we love the mother, uh, food prepared by our mothers as well we love our mothers right now everyone need to have some break right from the work from the busy schedule you all when you all come to school you all have break on sunday and even your fathers have holiday on sunday but have you ever thought do your mothers have a break they is there any day when they will say today is sunday and today is holiday i'm not going to work today no they work every day for you so sometimes we need to think about them and it's our duty to give them a small break how can we do that we can go to a restaurant and have a dine right along with our family you all love going to a restaurant yes we all like to dine out along with our family so today i'm going to take up a lesson on a restaurant lesson 3 who robbed the restaurant first of all i want you all to open your banyan tree book take out your pencils in order to underline some of the important word and using your index finger follow as i read out the lesson lesson 3 who robbed the restaurant preeti loved to dine out her parents restaurant underline the word dine out when her parents started it a year ago they spent all their time at the restaurant managing it however as the restaurant became more and more popular they decided to hire a manager underline the word hire and the last word in the paragraph manager it's so nice to have someone else take care of the restaurant in the evenings so that we can have some time to ourselves and also make plans to open another restaurant her father said her mother agreed it's like being on vacation but preeti did not like the manager underline the word manager there was something about the way he was looking over his shoulder all the time as if he was up to something he was not even friendly with the staff underline the word friendly it's an adjective form of the word friend friendly it's an adjective form late one evening preeti was just dropping off to sleep when the phone rang underline the word dropping off dropping off means falling asleep or fall asleep who would be calling this late she wondered she climbed out of bed and pressed her ear against the living room wall oh no oh no her father was exclaiming underline the word exclaiming We will get to the bottom of it. I am on my way there. Her father sighed. Underline the word sighed. The manager just called from the restaurant. He was closing up for the night when the robber came in and stole all the money out of the cash box. Underline the word cash box. What bad luck. Let's find out what happened before we call the police. underline the word police preeti persuaded her parents to let her come along to the restaurant since she was going to be left alone in the house underline the word persuaded 
I don't trust that man. She told herself. Okay, now everyone turn the page. The manager was waiting inside, standing near the empty cash box. Underline the word empty. Tell us what happened, Mr. Ganesh, her father said. Underline the word, Mr. Ganesh. This is very upsetting, sir. Underline upsetting. Upsetting means sad. Looking distressed. Underline the word distressed. Everyone had left for the night. I was alone. I was walking towards the door to lock it so that I could work at the cash desk. When a man burst in and shouted at me to turn around immediately and face the other way. Underline the word immediately. To turn around immediately and face the other way. I did as he said. And he took the money from the cash box. He then backed away towards the door. And a moment later, I heard the door slam shut. When I turned around and saw that he was gone, I called you. What did the man look like? asked Preeti's father. And what was he wearing? He looked rough, Mr. Ganesh declared. I have seen him around the place. He was young and tall with long hair and no moustache. He wore dirty jeans and black belt with a silver buckle and a black t-shirt with a picture of an eagle printed on the back. Underline some of the words here. Dirty jeans, black belt, silver buckle, black t-shirt, eagle, eagle. Go to the next paragraph. Which way did he turn when he left the restaurant? Did you hear a motorcycle start or did he escape on foot? Asked Preeti's mother. I have no idea, said the manager, sounding irritated. Underline the word irritated. And escape. Did he escape on foot? Underline escape and irritated. I told you he made me turn around as soon as he entered. I couldn't see a thing after that. Let's call the police now and don't touch anything. A team of experts from the police station will come to investigate. Underline the word investigate. Preeti's father continued. Don't bother, Preeti interrupt. Underline the word interrupt. Interrupt means talking in between. Okay? Don't bother, Preeti interrupt. You won't find anyone dressed like that because the real thief is right here in this room. Mr. Ganesh is lying about the robber. Underline the word lying. I'm sure he took all the money himself. Look here, the manager started. No, you look here, said Preeti. If your back was turned to the thief all the time, how could you notice that he was wearing a t-shirt with a picture of an eagle on the back? When Preeti pointed that out, her parents started asking questions. And before long, the manager broke down, broke down or wept, broke down, underline the word broke down, and admitted to stealing the money. The money was still in his briefcase, underline the word briefcase. Preeti was happy that they had caught the thief, but disappointed that he, her parents did not call the police. They decided to send him away and find a replacement as soon as possible. Underline the word replacement. 
they felt everyone should be given a second chance students wasn't it a mysterious story in this lesson we have a little girl named preeti her parents owned a restaurant they had opened it last year and it was quite popular and they wanted to hire a manager they even hired a manager in order to take care of the restaurant in their absence so one night they suddenly got a call from the manager that the restaurant had has been robbed now uh, let me come come to preeti that preeti did not like the manager at first sight she found something uh, very fishy or he was not good at his relationship even with the whole staff in the restaurant so she didn't like the uh, manager so when they got the call uh, preeti along with her parents uh, went to the restaurant and they when they went there they asked manager what happened so he explained that robber came suddenly and robber asked him to turn back or told that he he will kill the manager so what he did was he was turning back with his hands lifted so the robber came he took all the cash and ran away uh, so father Preeti's father asked for the description of the robber. So, uh, manager described him, telling that he was tall, he was young, he was wearing dirty jeans, black T-shirt, black belt with silver uh, buckle, and there was an eagle, picture of an eagle at his back. After hearing this. when mother asked a question regarding how did the robber leave with the car or uh, went walking on this the manager got very irritated and told that i was turning back and i couldn't see hearing this preeti was quite smart she she got a doubt on the manager so her parents were uh, thinking of calling a police at that moment preeti interrupted in between and told that you don't need to call a police because we have robber here the manager is lying that there was some robber there was no robber here he has taken all the cash at this moment the uh, preeti's parent repeatedly started asking question to the manager in which he got uh, broke down and he was uh, he had to admit that he himself had robbed all the money preeti was very happy that robber was caught but she was sad that manager was not sent to jail and her parents believed that everyone should be given a second chance so they gave second chance to this manager they told him to leave and they hired a new manager in this lesson we have some of the wo uh, important words here which you need to uh, have a note which you have already underlined preeti it's the name of the little girl dine out going for a restaurant or going for outside for your dinner is dine out Restor restaurant look at the spelling r e s t a u r a n t restaurant manager hire vacation dropping off dropping off means falling asleep dropping off exclaiming sight persuaded mr ganesh mr ganesh is the name of the manager upsetting distressed backed away investigate interrupted broke down replacement see you have to practice the spellings and be thorough with it till then jazakumullah khairan